Are you aware that people treat you differently because of your physical appearance? Yes, and, and I know that, that this is um, people viewing and watching say, oh, sure, she's ever had a problem, you know. But I have a hair and makeup team that gets me ready for today. I got to say, I saw her walking in this morning. <laughs> I didn't really recognize her. <laughs> yeah, we were riding the elevator together. I was like, la, 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 la. <laughs> he did. I was like, hey. He was like, right. oh, what? hello. Right. I was like, hello, little lady. How are you? I, my name's Anderson. Who are you? She was like, um, I'm Kristen. I was like, Kristen. <laughs> you don't look like Kristen Johnston. Ugh. I know, right? Yeah. Half of her height. But one thing that, that does happen to me is, um, um, and less so now that I'm more recognized, but still happens. Mm -hmm. I, I, will, I usually live my life with no makeup. I don't do my hair. Right? right? You saw me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wear sweats. Um, I have a very unique speaking voice, if you haven't noticed. And um, I'm petite. I'm 4'11". So when I wear sweats and I go, I'm not always taken seriously. Mm -hmm. And um, it, it sometimes bugs me. It's, yeah, you know, understandably. And, yeah, and they're like, where's your mom? I'm like, I am the mom.